Dear colleagues, the Climate Change and the Environmental Determinants of Health Unit and the virtual campus of uh, PARO WHO is pleased to welcome you to the virtual course on Mercury Effects in Human Health and the Environment and Considerations under the Minamata Convention, which has been prepared in collaboration with a multidisciplinary team of experts of the region in its first edition in English. Mercury, in its various forms and compounds, is a global neurotoxic pollutant of public health concern. The Minamata Convention requires countries to properly address mercury as an environmental health pollutant. The purpose of this course is to facilitate knowledge on the toxicology of mercury and its compounds to enable professionals in the area of public health and chemical safety to understand and to raise awareness about mercury exposures, prevention and mitigation. Participants are expected to be professionals who participate in service and research, environmental health and chemical safety from relevant institutions, working with environmental health planning, services and academics. The course will be carried out entirely online in the Moodle virtual educational platform of the Parro Virtual Campus. Course coordinators and tutors who are experts in the countries, working in governmental and non-governmental organizations, will provide support to the students, who are also professionals from similar institutions. So this is a peer environment. The course follows a modular structure that begins with a familiarization with the virtual classroom, including the first WebEx session, followed by six modules. The course explores the different forms of mercury and its compounds with the respective sources, environmental distribution, exposure routes, toxicological aspects, and prevention measures. In addition, we talk about the Minamata Convention and the World Health Resolution 6711 with its consideration on public health aspects of the convention. So, participants will read the interactive text with quizzes and self-reflective activities will perform individual written exercises and participate in discussion forums to exchange comments on the contents of certain units. There are synchronic WebEx sessions in key topics and a written exercise at the end of the course. There is also a forum for communication from the course coordination. Other details are presented in the course program available in the platform. The course is designed for a period of seven weeks, ending in early September. During this period of time, we suggest to allocate around the eight to ten hours of work per week to read, to participate in the activities, and to complete the required tasks of the course. It is very important that you participate proactively in, the, in all activities of the course to make the most of the available resources. Welcome to this platform, to online interactions in a friend, friendly and motivating environment for knowledge sharing. Thanks for your attention.